Hey guys, and welcome to season one of the Stranded Peacekeeper Challenge. This is an idea my community and I put together, inspired in part by Deadly Slob's Hardcore Challenge, as well as our previous Tour Defense series, which you can find the playlist for in my channel if you'd like to check that out later. If you're already familiar with the rules, feel free to skip to the timestamp below to get into the first raids. So for this series, we're playing the role of an Untar Peacekeeper who got left behind by their squad. If you're familiar with Hardcore, then the first rule will seem pretty familiar to you, which is that we can't use the Fleet Market, item insurance, therapist after raid healing service, and we can't use our scav at all. Now here's where it gets a bit more interesting. When we successfully extract from a map, we must head to the next map that Xfield connects to. Thanks to the help of my community, we have a map to map travel chart which links each Xfield to their closest possible map that currently exists in game. Now in some cases those extracts should connect to maps like terminal or town or something that doesn't exist yet, so in those cases the Xfields connect to the next possible. There's a link to this map chart as well as this rules page here down in the description if you'd like to reference it later and possibly try this challenge for yourself. So whenever we die we can only start again on a map that has a United Nations checkpoint which currently is customs and woods and we're also going to count the CCP temporary base on shoreline for this challenge as well. We must begin each raid with gear a UN worker could potentially have access to from outside Russia. Now Russia is part of the UN as well but for this series the idea is that your character came into the mess that is going on in Tarkov from outside the country and therefore would not have had access to the Kalashnikov weaponry, 6B brand armor, and other strictly Russian gear. While we're in raid though, anything goes. If we pick up an AK, it's fine to use until the end of the raid, but then when we get out, we need to sell it and start the next raid with a UN based loadout again. Our secure container will begin with only one free slot and the rest blocked off. I chose Bollock Lavas for this, but anything works really. Additional slots can be unlocked for 5,000 USD per slot, which is done by earning that much money, then deleting it along with one Bollock Lava from your secure container. We're starting as a USEC since they're starting gear is very much in line for this challenge. If you wanted to do the same idea as a bear, you could probably augment the rules a bit to make him something like a stranded soldier in the Russian military and have his starting maps be reserve and shoreline, again using the CCP temporary as a lore excuse for that one. Other than that, we don't have any super crazy rules. We can use vendors freely, we can use our secure container freely with any slots that are available in it. This is certainly designed to be more difficult than regular Tarkov and overall probably a bit easier than hardcore. The end goal is to get the hideout upgraded all the way with the exception of stopping the Bitcoin farm at level 1 and optional solar power only because it could take eons to actually find the things we need for those last couple upgrades in raid. I'm really excited to share this playthrough with you guys. We'll be rolling this out as a mini series all linked together in one playlist on this channel which will likely be around 10 to 12 episodes or so and we'll be weaving in other uploads in between over the upcoming weeks for Tarkov and a bit of Hunt Showdown as well. If you guys have any questions about this challenge or suggestions let me know in the comments. I'm always happy to hear your feedback. I live stream these raids for four days a week on Twitch, you should come by, link down in the description. And with that, let's begin Season 1. Look at that. I was not expecting him to just not die. Oh, come on. My thorax really gone. I, th I heal that so fast. Yeah, I'd say it's almost like, a, you know, an easier hardcore, but it'll be good. It's fun. Gonna loot right in this window. Fuck it, if I get shot, who cares? What did he have? He did have Untar armor, wall. Could you loot any slower? Okay. Use it? It's a... Uh, it's 
that 12 durability. This is 43. This is a little bit better, even though it's kind of bad. A T plug. Okay, we're gonna have to go. Oh, that was empty. We're gonna have to go underground. Pop that painkiller. It's gonna take 17 hydration though. Is that really a good idea? Oh, I need that for the... The thing. Use the SIGs. What's in it? No way. 61s. Oh. Okay. Can I have it? Alright. Oh, wow. I gotta take that. I'll just drink this. <sighs> to be honest, the odds of me surviving are pretty low. You can try turning the quality down a little bit, Michael. Might help. If you have any latency issues. Hey, Ravioli, thank you for gifting a sub to Baldi, man. Oh, this isn't full. Thought I loaded that. Oh no, it's just one. Ooh. Don't I need that later? Those are kind of annoying to get. Definitely want all those. Coffee's just money, right? I don't have any more. How did I not kill him? Exclamation uh, rules and cat. And yes. Oh my god, these guys are so geared. I can't believe I didn't kill him with the M61s. <laughs> How's that, Mike? <laughs> Thank you for the bits, dude. I don't think we're winning that one. <laughs> I didn't know there were two there. You think I stomached them? I really thought I had him with the the M61. I was so I was so proud of myself with the fake death there too. I think he bought it. Saw juice. Examine it for XP. Slurp it for juice. <laughs> it's gonna be really really hard to go D2 with those fuckers down there. It's funny because I think my fight alerted them to another guy or to each other. Oh my god, there's so many people. Dude, for anyone just getting here, my fucking thorax is blacked out. So I like I'm not trying I'm not trying to take any extra fights. Oh man. I 
don't need that. Probably have enough food too. I do want to take these keys. That'd be really good to have. This is assuming I don't get shot even one more time though. Yo, Tyler, thank you for your gift and a sub to Pro Young Gamer. <laughs> oh! Flavor! Flavor in a box. Uh, the hose, hose would be exceptional right now. The clock is honestly just money. I probably should toss it. Is that weird? Is that weird to toss the clock? Oh my god. Hello. Uh, that was dead if that was real. M tape? Need it for the hideout. Are you allowed to barter for meds? Yeah, we can buy and barter. Just normally. The clock is no use, right? You don't need the shuss until level 30, really? That's a long time to hold on to it. Yeah, I don't think we need the clock. Like, I'm just used to looting it because it's free money. Where's that metal? Where's that guy? Metal nearby. Ah, I can't think of it. There's like a lot of possibilities. Could have been on the roof. It's gonna be really hard to survive this one, guys. He's in my building. Isn't he? Yeah, basically only use that gear. The main goal for now? Well, for this raid is to survive, but I have a black and thorax, so... If I get shot pretty much anywhere, it's instant death. We could survive... Stomach, legs, and arm hits that don't black that limb, but if it does black the limb, we'll die. Because it'll spread damage to the thorax and kill me. I suppose it's not a must, Kring, but... Oh god. Fucking timing of that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh Is that another one? Huh. I was just listening because a lot of times there's scavs in here. Yeah, I was looking for this room for that reason. That was a good find. Doesn't necessarily have to be American gear. What's the story behind all the balaclavas? Uh, thank you for the bits, Ravioli. It's uh, blocking off my secure container, so we have we have one slot available, and we can unlock additional ones for five thousand U.S. dollars per slot. It's a Part of the challenge, exclamation rules to see all the rules. It'll give you a, it's a, it's a, just a small image I made that has all the rules posted on it. So you can see it more easily. Get a little snapshot view. If I go D2, I'm at factory? Okay. I actually didn't know that, so it's good to know. I think that's our best bet, right? Is just to go to D2? Ah! Oh god. That one always startles me. <laughs> Chicken, thank you for the bits. Okay, we're gonna crab walk down here because I want to listen and see if I hear any footsteps of raiders or ra uh, scavs or... Or somebody. 
running. Yeah, kind of mimicking open world. Yeah, I don't have RR. I can't go to cliff. Well, this sucks. I hear somebody down here. How bad is it if we take the sewer? It's actually not that bad. Let's consider it. I could toss a lot of my ammo and useless shit, put all the hoses and stuff in my rig. I would be better off. There's multiple people down here. If they're just scavs, I'd be alright, but I don't know. We also would be making a lot of noise. I feel like everywhere we're going, we're getting, like, pushed away. Who's the pack pack for customs or die in factory? Is that, like, how you see my choices? I'm just sneaking on the wood floor, by the way. This is the only wood floor in this building, in this area. That's, like, a huge giveaway. After that, I'm just gonna walk the... Yeah, I, I, either way I'll end up on customs. I'm not super worried about that right now. I'm more concerned with, uh... Like... Getting out alive, I guess. <laughs> uh, you know what I'll do? We'll run into- If we can get there, I'll run into the building. That's next to the exfil. And then, uh... Sort it out real quick. We'll toss the bullets and stuff. Oh wow. That's really nice. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Fuck the splints. So no matter what, we're either gonna leave or die here, so... The list of hideout items is helpful. Yeah. For sure. Well, I don't like that I heard a sniper rifle. Oh my god, that was so close. Oh boy. Where is he? You think that's the Lapua? Could be. You know, I'll sort my shit out here then. So... Let's toss what we can get rid of. How important are those keys? I need this later. Eat the food. <laughs> Just dicking around with all my... <laughs> All this random crap. Definitely need the pliers for gunsmith. And I'll eat the last painkiller too. And I'm just gonna YOLO it right for the X fill. Um it'd be nice to have that. So we can't buy keys, remember. Yeah. And I'm getting pretty nitty gritty, but we need this stuff that for the hideout. Yeah, maybe just drink the tea. Yeah, that's it. I'll hit this then. I know I just did, but I'm leaving it anyway, so I might as well. <laughs> Use the WD-40 as a flamethrower. Okay, this is it. We're just gonna have to YOLO it. Of 
course there's a fucking guy already. Dude, everywhere I go, there's someone blocking it. I don't have any ammo, I fucking threw it on the ground. Uh, that, yeah, that was a player skip. What is the point of saying any of that orange bar? <laughs> just cuz. I can't believe we survived that, man. My thorax is black and I couldn't take those fights. Alright. So, ow. So we can't heal with therapists. We gotta do it ourselves. <laughs> do some of these comments. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just like, what the heck. Alright. Well. Okay. I mean, it was a good raid. Let's eat some of that Salua that we were going to turn in anyway. So that's free heal. Uh, exclamation rules, guys. It's all in there. There's only a, there's only a couple lines of text, but um, no, we, we can buy from any vendor. But it has to be a Western style loadout, so we can't go in with some of the gear I just looted. Like, uh, these are like Russian. Actually, I don't know about the Hunter. Can I use a Hunter? Platform of Kalashnikov. Sounds Russian. So probably not. Gotta sell the SKS. Uh, sell that thing. <laughs> Leah. Like, <laughs> uh, I think we should buy a second uh, slot here. Well, we need. It's about 640k, right, to buy another gamma slot. How many dollars do we have? 900. So we need 4,100. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Where's my other dollars, man? Oh, yeah. oh my god. I'll save my five dollars, though. So yeah, in the rules, it's 5,000 to unlock a gamma slot. That's how you do it. Boom. You know what? I'll take a I'll take a weapon that takes two hands to carry for customs. How about that? Uh. All right, two hands. This gun takes two hands. All right, I don't want that or that on it. Keep my selling stuff down here for now. I'm gonna sort the stash later. For right now, it's not too big of a deal. Actually, I should just put a bird. No, because I already have this. Buy a gas block. No idea where that went. Yeah, I want to keep the top of my inventory clear like I usually do. It's so much easier to maneuver. Okay. It's probably not chambered. It never is. Um... I'm not gonna pre-paint at all, so I guess that's fine. Christmas gift for more USAC gear? Oh no, no, I'm not doing that. 
No, no I'll just I'll just start with the regular gear. All right. Uh. MA55 gonna be rough. Yeah, what's the stats on that? Let me look it up. I feel I feel like it's a little bit better than people give it credit for, but not great. 28 pen and 50 damage. Yeah, it's a little mediocre. <laughs> it's good. Yikes. It's not the worst, but it's not good. Let's take this water. I'll regret it if I don't. Oh, yeah, you can totally get one tap by it. If it hits you in the head, 28 pen. I mean, it can one shot a level 3 face shield. It, more often than not, would, I think, with 28 pen. I told Leo what? he had no balls if he did take my chat capabilities and he what? didn't even flinch. This Respect is a spawn? The place, mom still guy, though. This is a spawn. This is a spawn. Is this a joke? You actually need an intelligence folder early. Damn. Unlucky. Not really unlucky because that was a really good spawn, but. I should probably get out of here. Someone's gonna rush this, right? <gasps> what? We're gonna need that diary. I hate to take my CMS out, that feels really bad. M855 sucks. Wah. Get ratted, Oh, level. shit! <laughs> A rat! I don't know which, one, which one's better. I'll definitely wear that, though. Oh. So he has a friend. Tourist finished. I really need this guy's mags. Grenade landing sounds. Bruh. Hurry up. Oh my goodness, I'm so slow at it because my guy doesn't know how to fucking loot yet. Is it? Hee <laughs> hee. He. <laughs> uh, I mean, I want the gazelle or the whatever that's called. <laughs> you guys, I'm sorry I'm missing everything. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god.
Evan, thank you for the bits, man. Damn. 1,500 bits. Thank you so much, man. Sorry, guys. One sec. Um, I need dorms. What do I need? Oh, I gotta go across the fucking map, bitch. All right. That sucks. If I die, we don't, like, really get much out of this. Um... Didn't you- why didn't I ensure it's part of the challenge rules? Exclamation rules. Yes, I know there's another guy to loot. Give me a second! Alright. Oh. I just heard something. Where are the Zok? Oh, I didn't realize my armor was busted. <laughs> he thought I was a ghost. Though. I literally hear the man. It was a ghost step, he said. I feel like I could have played that better. You're a ghost step. Shattered mask gamer. Also, ow. I still think it was a ghost step. <laughs> Listen, man. I don't want to be that guy, but that was definitely a ghost step. Loud, Loud noises. noises. A -a 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 I knew I heard a little boy. So you might be wondering, why is he hiding this M4? It's not insured. Player scabs, that's all. I really don't want to toss this. I think I have to. Um... Should just heal with this and drop it probably. Yeah. Wait, now this has eleven on it. Oh, because that guy just shot me, right? Or is it glitched? The fuck? Yeah, thank you for the bits, Michael. <laughs> thank you for the 1500 bits, Evan. Sad Slayer, thank you for the gifted sub, man. It was fighting a fort, too? Yeah. I heard it. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, I shouldn't have tossed that. You can use it to craft Salua, but it's fine. Um... Yikes. Getting kind of heavy. 
Can't really take all this, can I? Uh so remember we can't really we can't actually use this ammo on this account. I'm not not gonna be able to like use it in a future raid. Rock. Can I utilize that? Yeah, I can. Motherfucker. He's so greedy. Fucker. I'm just really like pawing through the whole thing. Oh my god. <laughs> Level one strength. No. No. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! I How am I gonna get out of here? I don't have a I don't have a factory key. I have to go to old station or further even. Chad, walk it out. Oh, fuck! I'm wearing the worst of the armors too. Drop the Zuck, bro. It's crap. Nine kilos. Ditch the helmet, I guess. How's that look? Oh, that's not that bad. Drop empty mags. I think I did that, right? What empty mags? Oh yeah, I forgot to loot this guy. Let's open that as the factory key. Oh, we need that for the... Fuck! Actually, I need it more than this for the fucking hideout. Couldn't think of the words. This guy doesn't have anything. That's what he said, though. <laughs> they actually got good ammo on that, so I guess I'll keep the... Try run with stuff you don't care about. Yeah, I feel that. All good. You might see me die with this shit anyway. Oh, is your gun insured? Uh, your MP5? Honey, is it Honeys or Huns? Thank you for the prime. Welcome. I don't know if I'm saying your name right. I got to learn it. You know what I'm saying? If old gas isn't open, fuck. 
Yeah, I like this kind of gameplay, so... Thank you, Eco. <laughs> Pray that all gas is open, lol. Yeah, I am. This is the way. Literally am praying for that. It's good enough to run over the hill. Run and sit gameplay. Okay, we got scabby boys. Am I on painkillers? No. Probably should be. Crawl, baby. Yeah, but then you lose like a ton of stamina when you get up. It's kind of weird. Looks like it's not open. Another helmet. Alright, hold up. I'm gonna... Mission failed. We'll get him next time. Well, you know, not necessarily. <laughs> that aspect of it isn't great, though. Alright. Well, energy's getting low. I got any food? Yoink. Take the mag at an MP5. Yeah. Does that really do anything for me? Gives me one more slot. One more slot of air. I guess I could grab the uh, helmet now. <laughs> Cat, wait. Point, point zero eight. I suppose that's a fair question, though. I lost one notch of speed there. I don't think we want to loot the scabs, right? We just want to leave. Sorry for backseat? I don't care, you can backseat. As long as you guys don't get all weird and aggressive about it. <laughs> like, fucking idiot didn't take the thing, you know, but if it's just like, hey, do this, it's like, yeah, sure, I guess. I could take it under advisement. Two hours later. Oh, I'll need this ACAM for a quest. Oh, this looks looted. Just grab whatever's in here for money, I guess.
Nice. Nice work, fella. <laughs> Holy fuck, dude. I'm level three, motherfucker. I wonder what level I am now. Rigged. Surprised nobody said paid actors that entire race. 5,700. These two guys were geared as shit, man. I got, dude, I hit. We hit through the face shield with the 855 ammo. I told you guys, it's enough. 855 is enough. <laughs> we hit him in the face. And then he used his SR25 to kill the other. This guy was pretty geared too. We, we crushed his slick with the M61s. Also, I left all the doors in their default position and that really paid off because it didn't tip them off that I was in there. I think it paid off anyway. It seems like it did. So we got a slick. Uh, a whole big bag of stuff. Got a bunch more helmets. We got four new helmets. Well, three. Three new helmets. Greg has already had one of those. Okay, unfortunately, I can't use this AK, though. <laughs> that feels pretty bad. Alright, I'll have to figure it out with the loot. Um... 30k, well. But yeah, that was a face shield tap for sure. Can I fix it? Yes, okay, perfect. 